Next up, uh, we have Scrapebox. Scrapebox is literally mm, da, 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 on the market. So they've been around for like 10 years plus and they're still functioning and innovating at the end of the day, which is pretty cool because most tools have like a market life of, I don't know, two years and then they get bored, etc. Scrapebox has been around for like 12 years plus. Essentially what it does is, is it's a, it was designed initially as an SEO only tool, but then it became like the best scraper on the internet because it can scrape search results. And then it can also scrape internal sites so just uh, it like it does have a bit of a learning curve with regards to the platform itself but yeah also one important addition one important thing to mention is it does require proxies because if you scrape Google without a proxy you're gonna go to the dark ages very quick um, so the best proxy provider for Scrapebox is Scraper API. Like the amount of times that I'm asked this question with regards to what proxy to add is like maybe two times per day. Scraper API. What Scraper API does is instead of adding a bunch of proxies here, like let's say 10,000 or 50,000 or more, you just add Scraper API, they take care of the rest. Simple, they have like rotating proxies, so Google can't know that you're scraping directly from your laptop, because if, again, if you're scraping with your IP, forget about it. And the um, super cool thing, it can scrape websites as well. So not only Google search results, but it can scrape websites for emails, phone contact numbers, for cold calling, uh, social media profiles, etc. And as you can see right here, grab links, etc. You can also code out your own scrapers. Uh, so there is a bit of a bigger learning curve with regards to this and you do need to understand like the basics of code and just scrape box as well but essentially as like if you can see a pattern on a certain listing site uh with the data in between the pattern you just copy the pattern add it uh, i'll get into that later you add it like into the the back end of it's technical um you add it into the back end etc and it scrapes it uh pricing wise so they're priced at like 97 dollars um lifetime so you only pay it once uh on inside insight link in the description we have a discount for you to get it for 67 bucks so 67 dollars not affiliated but it's a discount i found on black hat world and um Essentially, yeah, you buy it once, uh, you keep it for life, super cool tool. If you want any other add-ons, of course, there's, a, there's an ongoing cost at the end of the day. But the, the biggest cost is on Scraper API because it's a monthly recurring cost and that's with regards to the proxies. But super cool tool, a lot of different applications, etc. like checking if, you know, a thousand domains, uh, which ones are dead and which ones are alive, etc. So many different variations.